Today we will take a deep look at how to configure the filters block in the sidebar section. This block based on Shopify's default filtering method. First, press on Customize filters to go to Shopify Admin Navigation Filters and view how to configure filters in the back end. Then click on Add filters and select the needed ones from the suggested list. We'll add all available product filters and two product options, size and color. We also want to change the filters placement, so we'll drag some to the need place and save changes. Now let's go back to the theme editor, product grid and tick the option enable default filtering to display filters in the sidebar. In the filters block you can choose the default state of filters. It can be open, closed. fixed or without a title. We'll leave open. In the content we can decide if to show filters in a column or in a row. If you set to show filters in two or three columns, you can also change the number of items in one column. We want it to be shown in two columns with four items in each column. In order to customize each separate filter, add a filter settings block. In the filter name field, type to what filter this block will be applied, for example, column. Here you can change the title and set the default state. If you want to show color items as a round color, enable the option Make its color circle. We also change the layout to show items in a row, and this is what we have got. Let's add another filter settings block. We want to show this filter without a title. As a final step, we'll navigate to Product Grid section and customize filters in the filtering. Here you can tick the option to show selected filters counter and button reset. And enable the option to show counter next to each filter item. Option items will be shown as unavailable with the inactive height disabled filters. Once you enable the option, the items will be hidden. The design of availability filter can be changed by enabling the option Make availability filter as a rounded checkbox. We also want to change a type of the price filter. Here you can select the need option from the drop down list. It can be shown as slider, inputs, or slider with inputs. If to enable the currency option in theme settings currency, the price filter will be shown only as a slider. We'll save all our changes and check how filters work. First, we'll select the white color and this is what we have got. Let's tick the pink color as well. You see, there are more items in the size filter. If to enable the price filter, only products that match selected parameters will be displayed. That's it! Thank you for being with the Shella Shopify team!